Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo. Actually, it's afternoon. I don't even know what time it is. It's 1 o'clock Eastern time. Yep, it's not morning. Uh, anyways, looking here at the SPY, I really thought the market would hold today. I uh, was a little bit aggressive here in the morning. I'm going to show you the stop out. I still think the market holds, but, you know, the later it gets, you know, what's the point? And again, the focus should be always on the morning for day traders, in my opinion. Anyways, we tried to hold right in here, boom, dropped, fell, open, we gapped up, made a new high in here, dropped, fell, broke, looked okay here, looked okay here, then we dropped off. So honestly, this looked like it was going to hold very quickly, but then it fell, and now I still think we hold at some point here, meaning I don't think we fall off a cliff, but I really um, was surprised we didn't hold better than this today. But I do think that overall, the market still looks very, very strong. Anyone that's shorting this market is an idiot, in my opinion. Um, whatever kind of little tiny move down we would have in here after this big sell-off wouldn't go really anywhere. And um, the market could have a megalodon move in this next two-week period because of such a big earnings season. And there's so many big names reporting. And if you'd want to do anything, you certainly wouldn't want to be against the trend of the market knowing about the big earnings that are coming up. So either I would selectively trade the market in specific setups if you're doing it or stay away from the market in the next two weeks until these names report. Focus on stocks. It's the best thing to do. It is earnings season. If you're interested in more information on learning my method, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a good day, everyone. Oh, next class is November 3rd and 4th.